Hey, it's Dale again from the WebHub class, and uh, one of the requirements with Project 3 is that you add social icons to your site. So I have my very ugly customized demo site here. Please do not have your site look like this. I am not uh, pretending that this is the uh, best example. I was just showing you some of the examples of customization within divs. Um, but now I want to go ahead and add some social icons here, and I want them to go right underneath the H1 here. Um, so there are a couple of different ways I can do this. Um, here's where I want them to go right here. Um, the first way is the um, fairly boring way, but it still is effective. Uh, I'm going to make an unordered list, so that's going to be bullet points. And I'm going to name this social so that I can go in later and add some customization to this. So I'm going to have uh, a couple of these. And then I'm going to close my unordered list. So if I go Twitter, Facebook, and Tumblr. So now I'm going to go ahead and save this. I haven't linked to anything here, but um, it should still show up on my page now as an unordered list. Okay, so we're good to go there. Now, uh, what I want to show you is that you can go into your custom and because again that was an ID so you label an ID inside your CSS with a pound sign and we called that social so now I can go in here and add some customization to those so let's say I want the text color to be black and I'm gonna go ahead and save that and it changed just the items that are inside this uh, ID called social. So that means you could also go in here if you wanted to and add a background color. So let's say I wanted that background color to be red. This is going to look horrible. So again, please do not uh, follow these instructions other than just the process that I'm explaining. But now we've got a red background. Um, you could even go in and change the um, size of that red background if you think um, it's going all the way to the right so if I tell it I want a margin right of 750, 750 pixels this should move it quite a bit over so there you go now I've shortened it a little bit okay so I just wanted to explain that you could add customization within an ordered list through your custom CSS so what I'm going to do is go back to my index and I'm going to go ahead and add these links. So you know how to do that. We already have, uh, so this would be the code for here. I'm going to add the a tags here. So I'm going to use that pound sign just uh, for the dummy links, just to make sure they're working. So now we have links again. Okay, so they're all working and we're good to go. Now I could go in and change the color of those links if I want. Again, you just do that through your custom CSS within the social ID. Um, you could go ahead and change all those colors. But that's one way to add your social accounts you would actually add the exact links there now there's one other way or there are several other ways but one other way that I just uh, want to show you quickly um, I've found a couple of icons that were free to use from the authors um, and I've saved them already in my IMG folder within the project 3 folder so I found a Facebook a Tumblr and a Twitter icon so instead of an unordered list, I'm going to get rid of that. And now I'm just going to put this inside a paragraph. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to add those images. So again, you already know how to add an image. Um, I need to tell it, look in the IMG folder and then find facebook.jpg. Okay, so let me save that one first just to make sure it's working. So there you have the icon that's a little bit big. I would probably want that icon much smaller, but just for the purposes of this, um, we're going to go ahead and, and move on with it.
So I'm going to space a little bit and I'll do the same thing for the others. Again, IMG folder and now we'll do twitter.jpg and IMG source equals IMG folder and tumblr.jpg. Okay, so let's save these and make sure they all worked. Oh, Tumblr did not work. What did I do? IMG source equals IMG slash Tumblr.jpg. Um, I need to go back here. Tumblr.jpg. Why is that not working? IMG source IMG slash Tumblr.jpg. Um, okay, let's see. Tumblr.jpg. So this is often what happens. Um, now I need to figure out where it is getting this from. I'm going to inspect element. IMG source. Ah, there it is. I did not close the quotes. You can see one little uh, error can throw off your site. So now when I save, there I have my icons. So now I can just go back in here and add my ahrefs around the images and then I would close that uh, a tag right here. I'm gonna go ahead and just do this for all three since I just have those dummy URLs in there and then I can go right here and just grab a closing a tag and you wanna close that right around the image. So when I save that now these will link to my specific Twitter accounts once you put in um, the exact URL in there. So several ways for you to do social icons. Those are two of them. Uh, make sure you have at least three social accounts attached to your new site. Um, get creative with it. Make it look, uh, make it look good and make it be uh, highly usable and easy to understand.